Hi, it's Anne from The Useless Crafter. So uh, recently I experimented with gold foil because one of, I don't know if you guys remember, but I had an old uh, giveaway for a wedding acrylic sign and um, my winner said, go ahead and experiment, try the gold foil. So I tried it on this little keychain and I loved it. And so I then went to a bigger sign and did a thank you sign. And I got so many questions. So I thought, you know, we should just experiment and see what works and what doesn't work. So everything that I have here is from Amazon. So you can always check my Amazon shop. I love these five by seven acrylic signs. Um, they come super nice as you can see, but I need to peel it off. Um, so while I'm peeling it off, let's talk about the gold flakes. The first one that I did for this sign and for this came in this um, little uh, jar. So they're just flakes that you put on. I used what was recommended, which was the Speedball Metal Leaf um, Adhesive, I guess. So you just kind of brush it on and then you put your gold leaves on. So I'm going to show that on this, um, but I'm also going to try, I have a feeling that my Barely Art glue will work just, as fi just fine. Um, so we're going to be doing the gold leaf sheets, which is what I have here. We're gonna try that out to see how easy it is to use because uh, I heard from some that you guys don't have this available to you, the flakes. So we're just gonna try out a few different things and see what works best. Um, see if there's any difference in the ease, uh, you know, like how easy it is to use it. And if there isn't and all this works, then that's great because then we can do price comparison, um, what you already have, what's available in your area. So I'm super excited about that. So I don't have anything to put on this sign. This sign is just purely for experimenting. So there's gonna be no, um, no saying on there. Now, while I'm peeling this off though, and I have your attention, when you do do a sign like I did for thank you, my biggest tip for the acrylic sign is to draw out what you're gonna put on your acrylic sign so that it goes underneath your acrylic sign, like under here, so that you have a template and you don't have to worry about is it straight, is it aligned, how, you know, um, is it too close to the other word? So if you just have it uh, designed out in design space and then actually um, have it drawn out then you just follow your template all right so let's get started I have everything here that I want um, oh you know what I don't have I don't have a brush give me a second to go grab my brush okay I used this last time it's just a regular brush and I'm gonna do it here so I'm gonna do basically there we go. Um, I'm gonna do a line, like a little bit here. I'm gonna do four lines. Um, I'm gonna do the gold flakes in both this and my Barely Art glue. Cause I think a lot of you guys have Barely Art glue because you already um, you know, use most of the same supplies that I do. And I love this for, you know, for my cardstock. So let's see what works and what doesn't work. All right, ooh, I don't want this on my hand, all right. So it comes out, it looks like, like a watery glue, okay? So this is what I did last time. I just put this down. And I might not wanna do this much because I don't wanna waste my, <laughs> waste my stuff. All right, I'm gonna close this up. Get my pad out here. All right, so here are my gold flakes. I'm just gonna open this up. I don't want to waste anything so I'm gonna take this take my tweezers and you can see I'm just putting it down and then it falls down right away it's super easy to use and apply and take And then once it dries, it's so pretty. Um, 
it doesn't come off so you just want to make sure that you cover um, you know the the glue part or whatever the adhesive um, and you want to make sure that your gold flakes all of it touches down onto the glue because I'll show you in a second on this one there's a section right here that didn't that's kind of just sitting on top so that's why it's not you know dried and it's still popping up and you can see look at my it's huge this is just I think the sheets kind of crumpled up try to take out so see it's a big big piece okay so there you have the first one it's really pretty all right I'm gonna close this up we're gonna try the gold sheets so here is my sheet. Oh shoot, I pulled out too much. Okay, I don't wanna waste it. Okay, oh man. All right, I'm gonna put this back. Hopefully I didn't ruin that. Here's my sheet. I'm gonna rip up the sheet in half because I'm gonna use Barely Art Glue on one of them. And I'm gonna use this. Ah, I have it on my hands. Okay, now we're gonna use the sheets, which now I'm thinking it's gonna be exactly like this because we had some pieces that were really big like that. All right, so here we go. Let's see if this is easier to use or not. My hands are, I have glue on my hands, so it's probably not the best. It looks the same, just that, you know, because they were the flakes, I probably can cut them up because I used my hands right here. They look identical down. So I don't know if you can, um, you can probably see it. I wouldn't be able to tell. They look the same. Just the, the sheets were messier for me. So I'm gonna put this aside. Oh no, I need to use this because I'm gonna try it with my Barely Art glue. All right, so, oh my gosh. <laughs> my hands, my fingers are so sticky, so it's sticky. All right, I'm gonna try it over here. And I'm gonna do it like this. And you're probably gonna want to brush it a little bit, right, to get a thicker line. Okay, so, um, but I don't have a clean brush and I don't wanna mix my two ingredients or my two glue. All right, so here we go. thinking anything's gonna work here. All right, so I have my sheets out. I mean, this now looks like flakes, right? So. So just from ease of use right away, because I don't, I've only used the gold flakes one, two extra times before the sheets. Um, I feel like it's just easier, it's less messy. 
Um, all right, so my Barely Art glue is down. It looks the same, doesn't it? All right, and then I'm gonna try the flakes right over here. So for the flakes, I don't stick my hands in. I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna grab it with this. So yeah, it's the same. Um, I'm gonna have to look up the price and see how much, if there's a difference in price, whether it's in the sheets or the flakes. Um, as far as whether or not the glue works, I'm going to post it in comments because I'm going to let it dry and see what it looks like tomorrow. But right now, as far as I can tell, sheets and flakes are the same. And we'll see if Barely Art Glue dries or not. All right. All right. See you guys in a little bit.